Hi, I'm Tanya Burr and I'm here to show you my daily beauty look with Harper's Bazaar UK. Okay, I'm going to start off by using the Authored Tinted Moisturiser. This is it. I'm going to use shade 3 today. I'm not quite my kind of winter palest colour yet, but um, which is 2, my shade in winter. But I've also kind of, I'm not really shade 4 anymore, which is my tanned colour. So I'm kind of in between. I just put some, just pop some onto this brush here, the Surreal Techniques brush. And then I just kind of dot it over my skin. And to prep my skin for makeup, I have um, moisturised, cleanse and moisturised this morning. That is it. Keep it very simple. Oh, and use some eye cream. I love the Sunday Riley eye cream. Just to kind of make sure I'm hydrated. So I really wanted to create a tinted moisturiser that lasts all day because for me, I feel like my skin doesn't need full coverage all over and I love my skin to look like skin. And so I prefer to wear a tinted moisturiser rather than a foundation. Oh, this is the perfect colour for me today. And then I can just use concealer on the areas where I need it, like on little, the other little breakout. Or I suffer with pigmentation on my forehead, which is so annoying. And I wear SPF 50 all the time now in the sun, but when I was younger, I didn't. So, um, really regret that. <laughs> so if you're younger than me, start wearing your SPF now. Don't wait until you're 30 to do it. Okay, so next is concealer. I use the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. And I have two shades because I use one for under my eyes, which is shade vanilla. And I use one to give me a bit more coverage for my pigmentation. Naughty, naughty. Although I keep my beauty look pretty simple, it's so important to me and I really think that I've found kind of my place with beauty and what it means to me and kind of the part that it plays in my life now. I just find having a simple makeup look, like a go-to look, I don't change my look really ever, um, unless I'm doing some kind of special red carpet event and have a makeup artist doing my makeup. Um, then I might play around and do kind of a red lip or a really smoky eye or some kind of dramatic winged liner or something. But day to day, I don't really change my beauty look because for me, I need it to be go-to, easy, quick, and just make me feel like me. I don't want to be feeling, you know, like I'm dressed up or putting on a look that doesn't make me feel like myself day to day. I'm going to do some bronzer now. This is a Dior bronzer, excuse how dirty I've made it. Um, this is the colour. So I'm doing a bit of contouring. I always think a bit of jawline contouring is nice. It's one of my beauty tips. Probably not that original. And I just did a bit in the cheekbones and the forehead. Next, I'm going to use a little bit of Hourglass. Ooh, this is very shiny and difficult to show you guys, but this is Hourglass Ambient Lighting Bronzer Luminous Bronze Light. And it's so pretty. Look at that. It's just gorgeous. I just put a little bit of this kind of on the apples of my cheeks and just sweep it around the place. Just adds a nice kind of bronzy glow. I haven't been using blusher. I just use this as my blusher. And if I feel like it, sometimes I take a little, this is a MAC 217 brush and get a little bit of this. And this is the only eyeshadow I use. Like I literally just put a little bit of this on my eyes. And I feel like I really love when your eye makeup and your skin makeup is the same color, even though that sounds really weird. Like it would blend your eyes into your face, but trust me. But that's what I love about makeup is you don't have to follow any rules. You can just take a product and put it wherever you like and um, just do what you want with it to create the look that you want to achieve. I love that. I'm glad I put that on my eyes today. Oh, I forgot a step. So whilst my I'm doing the rest of my makeup, I like to put on some lip balm. This is the Authored Lip Balm. I love the packaging so much and it's all aluminium, which is great and sustainable. So this is the lip balm I'm just putting on now. And I think it's nice to kind of just have lip balm on whilst you're doing the rest of your makeup so that your lips can be hydrated. 
and it has a really lovely finish so sometimes I literally will just wear this but I am going to put on I kind of dab a lipstick over the top which I'll show you in a bit okay brows I've had my brows microbladed so I don't need to do too much kind of extra filling in I just need a brow gel um but I do use a tiny bit of the Kevin Aquan this is the precision brow pencil which I do think really is the best just need it kind of here because you can draw little hairlines like how clever is that yeah you can see that it's just my microblading's faded a little bit there so I just need to draw kind of some extra hairlines and then maybe some at the edge too and then you can just brush them through with the brush on the other end and it just kind of keeps them looking natural these are the Kevin Aquan lash curlers and they're by far the best lash curlers in the business. Time for the best moment in doing my makeup. It's mascara. This is the authored mascara. And the mascara, as you can see, is so good. Yeah, this is all I'm gonna do for my lashes today. If I'm, for every day, I don't wear mascara on my bottom lashes anymore, I used to, but I just kind of do one coat on the top. But back to skin, um, this is called MAC Cream Colour Base and it's in the shade Hush. And I just get a little bit on my finger and just tap that on the tops of my cheekbones. I do powder through, the, through my T-zone if I'm going out in the evening and, or if there's going to be any kind of flash photography, but just for day to day. I don't use it and I, I just love the effect this has. Finally, I use Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk, which is this colour here. It's a lipstick, but my lips feel hydrated and gorgeous from the Authored Lip Balm. And so it just makes this go more natural. So you can just see it adds a slight bit of colour. So I just tap it on like that. And then, with a clean finger, just blend it in a little bit. And that is it. That's my daily beauty routine. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon.